everybody Ann here just sitting here in the tiny house having my coffee with all of you and well um you know it's kind of cloudy outside but it's not super cold I just turned the propane heat on for a little while and I've turned it off because it's warm enough in here and so the GoFundMe is live and the information how to donate directly to the vet uh, is live and of course my PayPal account I've already received some donations. Um, I've received one GoFundMe and I think two or three via PayPal. So at the end of this video, I will, you know, list on my little thingy, the outro, um, giving thanks to the people who have donated so far. And it's coming along. Hopefully we'll get to this $800 mark soon so that I don't have to keep stressing out about it. But even if it doesn't, you know what, I can keep the, keep the things up and, um, each time he has a payment the first time it's going to be like 300 bucks and then the next two after that I think it's like a two 250 a piece something like that uh so it's coming along and I'm very very grateful it was hard for me to do this I didn't I didn't want to do it you know I mean it's weird because when I was trying to set it up I kept having problems you know the GoFundMe thing it, it wouldn't let me do it and it was making me mad so anyhow well, uh, I think today I may have a couple visitors, may split some more wood, um, so we'll just see how that goes. The egg haul is only three white eggs today, pretty good sized. Uh, you know, it's a little after 11, so maybe they'll go back in there. I'm going to try and put some extra food out for them out here today, so maybe they'll stick around here for a little bit longer. Maybe I'll get a brown egg, maybe I won't. Look at who we got here. This is Miss Patsy. She flew the coop. I need to trim her wings again. And hopefully that'll keep her from flying out when I don't want her to. So we're just going to wait and see if this works. Snipping time. Oh, my visitors just got here. Look who's here. Hey, guys. Hi, What's Hi. up? You brought me pallets. Those are, those are nice pallets. Thank you. You know what? I know that you might want me to put my wood up on this. I got a couple that I can use for that. These are great planks for the walls. Yep. I could pull these off. All I need. Where did you get these? I found an ad on Facebook Marketplace. The guy said he had some free pallets. Was having trouble getting people to haul them off. So we went up there. There's a total of 145 pallets. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, when we're done here, I want you to give me the information. Does he still have some? Not at all. Oh. Look at these. These are nice wide boards. Yeah. All right. I may have to do that. So, well, let's get these off of here. And did you bring your wood splitter? I did. It's on the other side of the couch right there. It is. Yay. It's yeah, wood splitting time. Logs broke up for mm -hmm. you. Awesome. Thank you so much, you guys. Yep. What are you doing, Andy? I just the wood with my toys. Yay. I'll, I'll come and gather them up and bring them over to the wood pile. Looky there, we're on the last one. 
That's a big one too. Look at this wood pile, guys. It's getting big. It's getting huge. So what are, you, what are we gonna do next, Andy? We're gonna play the chainsaw. Hey, Andy, what you gonna do? I'm about to cut down a tree, Miss Ann. Right on, go for it, man. <laughs> Well, you're welcome to stay here and split all that up if you want. I'll think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, you guys. All that, that's the white oak, and that tree has been dead for a long time, so that's going to be drier. I'm going to be able to split some of it up myself, but we don't need to use the log splitter anymore today. Look at all that. It's all replenished. Remember it? It was down to this level. Now I've got all of this. Thank you, Andy. No problem, <sighs> And this is the way we do it out here. We barter. Of course, they would have done it for free, but I am bringing them a dozen beautiful eggs. Oh, and at the end of this video, you're going to see all the contributions that I've received thus far for Papa's Care. Thank you, everyone who's been donating. It means so very much. And I'm going to be able to get this done. Even if we don't have the whole amount on February 18th, if I've at least got $300, then I'll be able to start his treatment, and I feel confident that we're going to be able to do it. So thank you very much, you guys. And the links will be posted down below again for your convenience if you decide you still can donate. Anyhow, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. <laughs>
thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.